Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how you can implement share, screenshot and text feature in your Unity project. The first thing you need to do is download this asset, a free native share for Android and iOS. The link will be in the description. Click this button to add to your asset. After you have added the asset, click Asset Store and click Import. After the import is complete, we need to do some setup for the plugin. Now go to GitHub page of the asset. Look for Android setup. And as you can see, we need to add this provider into our Android manifest file. Go back to our Unity project and look for the Android manifest file. If your plugin folder does not contain any manifest file, you should create a new folder called Android. And if you are on Windows, you should copy Unity default Android manifest from this location. Or if you are on Mac OS, you can find the file in the Unity application folder. Playback engines, Android player, apk this is the file you're looking for and you can drop it into the android folder once you have the android manifest file ready you can double click it and we need to go back to the github page and copy this provider paste it inside the application tag Now, we need to rename the authorities into a new unit string. Any unit string. Share 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, now we are done. Okay, after the setup is done, we need to create a button for the share function to be triggered. Reset. Let's call this button share and rename the button to share button. Now we need to create a script for the buttons. Right click, create a new folder called scripts, create a new script called share button. Then we add the script into the button okay double click the share button script remove the start and update method create a new method call click share then we go back to the github pages and look for the sample code section and copy this next screenshot method paste into our script mm. let me do some formatting and remove the command uh, the arrow should be show up let me restart my editor Okay, now the error is there. Fix the error by import using a system.io. Now we can start the call loading, take screenshot and share. You can change your share subject over here. Let me change to my games and the content over here. I score 10 points in my games okay done go back to the unity now we need to add the on click listener to the share button look for on click click the plus button 
and add the share button into the object. Look for share button, click share function. Now we are ready to test on the editor. Click play. Click the share. When you saw the log, means we have successfully integrated the plugin. Now let us test on the Android emulator. File, view setting, switch the platform to Android. Wait for a while. Now, build and run. Share, test. Click save. Oops, I need to use a different bundle identifier. Share, test. Click view and save again. Now, we have to wait for the build. I will stop the video now and continue later. Now, the build is ready. Now, click the share button. Let me try share on the message first. New message and a random number recipient. As you can see, the screenshot is over here and the content is over here. Let me try on the Facebook. Click the Facebook. As you can see, the screenshot is over here without the text content. Um, in some social media, the screenshot sharing and text does not work together. If I am not wrong, Facebook and Twitter only accept image sharing. In that case, you should make your method to share screenshot only. Let us copy this line and comment the previous line. Remove the subject and text. This will be to share image only. Now I will show you guys how to share a local image instead of a screenshot. Create a coloutine. I emulator load image and share mm, copy these two lines we are reuse it to save the image in a temporary location now mm, we need a texture 2d i think texture texture 2d image resources dot load image type of texture 2d as texture 2d mm, we change the ss to the image and you return a frame to make sure the image is ready. Now copy the native share method and paste it over here. Okay, now our method is ready. Comment this line as this is for take screenshot only. Now we are using a load local image start call routine for load image and share okay done as just now we are using a resource dot load method we need to create a new resource folder the resource dot load method will load all the resources in this folder now we tr try to get the image, drop it into that folder. 
make sure your image is red and right enable and no compression click apply now our image is ready let us test on the emulator file view and run i will stop the video now and continue later now the build is ready let's try click the share button and try on facebook As you can see, the image now is using our local image instead of the screenshot. So that's it for Android and iOS do not require any additional setup. It should work fine with current configuration. I hope this tutorial helps you. If it did, please give this tutorial a like and also subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video.